Hey there, everybody. Thomas Wood with Basecamp Trading. It is Friday, December 2nd. Uh, we're going to take a look at the dollar index here. Now, first I want to say this. Long-term dollar index is in an uptrend on the monthlies, weeklies, etc. Uh, and we just broke through a weekly trend line or a, a weekly and a monthly trend line. So longer term, it's still bullish. However, short term, short term on this 240 minute price chart, you're forming a head and shoulders pattern. So you have your left shoulder, your head and your right shoulder, and you have a really well-defined neckline. And that neckline is going to be the support right here at 100.675. So keep an eye on this, um, either the rest of today and going into early next week watch to see if it can break that neckline. If we can, then we should get a, a nice little drop. Now again, I'm not saying it's going to completely reverse, but I wouldn't be surprised to see it pull down to about 100 even or so. Now the other thing you want to pay attention to is this trend line going across your highs. If this trend line is broken, if we break through this downtrend line, then we're looking to resume the up move and we're looking for a continuation of the uptrend. The other thing that that'll give us is if this waits until next week to do that, that would give us a weekly bull flag, which would suggest it continues to climb for a swing trade. Okay, so short term, watch for a break of the support and for a little bit of a drop, potentially down to about 100 level. However, long term, we're still in uptrend. Watch for the break of the trend line to resume the long term up move and for the longer term continuation to the upside. Uh, the reason I show you both is because there's opportunities going both with and against the trend. Uh, you just have to manage your trade correctly. And just be aware that your target, your profit target is going to be much closer if you're going counter trend than if you're going with the trend longer term. So fundamental thing I'm trying to teach you here is pay attention to what the underlying trend is and then adjust your profit targets and, and understand the distance that that market should move according to where your long term expectations for that market are. All right. That's all I have for you for today. Have a great weekend. I'll see you in the trading room on Monday. And until next time, happy trading.